Hey, welcome to 3D Bad Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to fasten your tempered glass bed to your under three without using your binder clips or your duct tape. You take both those, throw them out of here because you're going to learn the glue stick method. Let's try it out. The first step you're going to do is disable steppers. The reason behind this is because you need manual access over the X access bar. To move the X access bar, place your hand securely on top, one hand underneath the X access bar, and lift while you are pressing down on your machine. You're going to need to gather a few materials, such as a knife, glue stick, calipers, and hopefully something to cut on. Now it's time to make your 2.5 millimeter glue pucks. Twist out roughly 2.5 millimeters worth of glue. Then take your knife and cut flush against the top of the glue stick, creating a nice glue puck. And repeat this step four more times. It's great to have five contact points on your glass bed. Make sure your glass is clean and dry. Then we can flip it over to the back side where the Creality image is not so apparent and you can place a glue puck in each corner and also in the center of your glass bud. Carefully escort your glass bed to your machine. Place it on top. Take your thumbs and push down firmly while holding the aluminum bed so it does not push your machine or possibly bend your bed. Do the same thing to the back side as well. When it comes to the middle, this part tends to be a little bit more difficult. You're going to have to apply more resistance and more downforce. Now take your knife and scrape off the remaining glue that was squeezed out from underneath the bud. For my personal preference, I have found bed weld to be the best for my personal needs. To apply bed weld, shake vigorously. Then. Squeeze slightly and press down on the applicator, go in small circular motions on the back side, then pull to the front, creating a nice clear film. Repeat this step for another layer. Let the bed weld air dry for at least five minutes. Prematurely turning on your heated bed will evaporate the bed weld and cause it not to work properly. I wanted to say thank you for watching my video demonstration. I hope this video helps guide you in the right direction for whichever method you choose to prefer. None is wrong and none is right. It's just whichever works best for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you and take care.